This is Mission. Authorities of the Bodhi District Assembly in the Western North Region are strategizing in setting up a rehabilitation center for persons with disability, especially children suffering from cerebral palsy. Bright Nana Amfo tells the story of an eight-year-old Patrick who lives on a cocoa plantation in the Bodhi District. His parents are struggling to find an institution in the district mm. to rehabilitate him. The journey to Patrick's home lasted 30 minutes. Atiemokrum is in the Bodhi district of the Western North region. Patrick had been left alone and that is normal. He's always left behind because the parents must work. They are farmers. Few seconds later, Patrick's mom and dad arrives. First, he had to be taken care of. This is a regular routine because he might have soiled himself. Feeding him presents another difficulty. So this is Patrick uh, being given water. Uh, he virtually spends the whole day on this uh, veranda, even when the parents are not in. But when they come back from farm, they'll have to help him with a lot. In fact, most of the things that Patrick will have to do, drinking water, eating, and virtually everything. Patrick is eight years old. The assembly is supporting his parent to be able to look after him. But Patrick needs more than that. His disability has brought hardship to his family. His disability has brought a lot of hardship. One has to do everything for him, including attending to nature school. Taking care of Patrick is a headache. His father is equally disturbed. He was born with the disability. We tried to correct it, but it didn't work. We thought it was normal until we realized it was a disability. After two years, he still could not walk, and we gave up hope. Patrick's father recounts times when they feel like giving up on him. You need money to treat a disability like that. So we tried herbs, but to no avail. He will soil himself several times, and when his mother is tired of him, she will threaten that one day she might leave him and run away. They have done all, including prayers. We heard it on radio about support from the district assembly. The mother took the lead and I followed. After some visits, we got support in the form of cars to look after Patrick. The assembly has supported Patrick's family. But... This is inadequate. And so, if a full pounded machine had been given to Patrick's father as part of his share of the 3% District Assembly Common Fund for persons with disability, the Social Welfare Department of the Bodhi District Assembly says it pays particular attention to persons with disability. We are challenged as a district, but we are doing our best to talk about these rehabilitation centers. Persons like my, my friend um, Patrick needs to be provided with these services. We would like to call on benevolent institutions to come to the aid of the districts so that we may be able to put up these structures and provide these services to persons as such so that their lives will also be improved. Patrick's family seeks more support. <laughs> I was told Patrick can go to school by people who said they have seen his kind on TV. 
I haven't watched TV since I got married 10 years ago. I will be happy if he goes to school because Patrick has been suffering. So if I get someone to help Patrick to go to school, I will be happy. But this is not forthcoming immediately. We are seriously at the table on that. Seriously trying to look at. We are even trying to, you know, be in touch with some of the districts around that genuine ones. Then maybe if we can all come together and get one at the center where everybody will go there. We are trying to do that. We both initiated it. We are in touch with Joaboso, Swama, Akontomra. Then we come together. So maybe by next year, the budget that we write, we try to prepare for 2020. I'm advocating, I'm trying to uh, ask my friends to come in, then we will put those, uh, we allocate some money for that, and we get a centre, put out some, something like that to help the, the people. The Assembly, however, says it has put in measures to ensure the 3% District Assembly Common Fund is well distributed to persons with disability. Patrick's family is looking up to more support from both the state and individuals to ensure he lives a decent life. Bright Nananfu, TV3, Atiamokrum, Western North Region. And that's it for mission. But Esla, um, this is something that uh, I'm sure um, he can, Patrick can get some assistance. It's so heartbreaking yes. to see that in that whole area, there is yes. no school, no facility for children with intellectual and physical disabilities and so we do need to think about extending those facilities and if you hear the district executive and his lamentation that a few districts have to come together yes. to provision that i think the the ministry of education should think about putting up a facility like that there yes. because there's i'm sure there are children with similar challenges physical challenges in that area who are hitting away in homes for want of any assistance from, from central government. Yes, I know the Ministry of Education has a special They do, uh, they schools. have a special schools yes. unit. And the National Council on Persons with, with Disabilities, disability. and they've yes. been doing some monitoring with the Common Fund Administrator. Yeah, you can imagine uh, yes. how exhausted yes. the, ma the parents must yes. be having to care yes. for this child without any assistance, no help. Okay. Yeah.